A new knife crackdown after another ugly night on our streets. A guard of honour as hundreds farewell 12-year-old Kyle Vassell. Melbourne's 13 housing hotspots where every property is snapped up. And Australia applauds a gutsy effort as Canada is forced to apologise. Live from Melbourne, this is 7 News with Jennifer Kite. Good evening. Police and the state government say they're stepping up efforts to take knives off our streets after another two stabbings overnight. Reporter Ben McNair has been following the story. And Ben, what does the government plan to do about the problem? Jen, after another violent night across Melbourne, the government says it's cracking down on the sale of... Registration for the walk is from 8 tomorrow morning at the TAN. All time for sport now with Tim Watson. Thanks, Jen. Coming up tonight, Leighton Hewitt calls a truce with Bernard Tomic. Also, Barry's back as a bulldog. Bigger and maybe better. And the Aussies continue their smashing form in the 2020. Barry Hall has justified his recruitment to the Bulldogs in a best-on-ground performance against Hawthorne last night. In his first game for the Dogs, Hall booted six goals as they steamrolled their way past the Hawks by 57 points. He might have been wearing a different jumper, but last night was vintage Hall. And Jen, that's sport. Thank you very much, Tim. And still ahead, all the weather details for the coming week. Lovely midweek, sunny and a top of 28. Then a few more isolated showers later in the week. And that's 7 News for now from the team. Have a lovely evening and good night.